What's going on everyone and welcome to the next episode of the Thursday questions on the Apple Fox channel and this time we're going to talk about the unlocking and locking the more specifically the topic is going to be how to make your Apple Watch lock every time. Let's begin with this video right now. Okay, so there are people like me that use either Apple Pay or simply want their Apple Watch to be as secure as possible, so they set up a passcode like I have. But there are some settings that you can tweak that will make this a lot more useful for you. Let's say that you just want to keep your Apple Watch locked every single time. You know, there is this thing called the wrist detection. It means that if I put the Apple Watch on my wrist, and right now when it just feels the presence of the skin of my wrist, right now if I type the passcode in, it doesn't matter what I do, every time I just go back and then I just tap to make it sleep or whatever, it will not ask me for the passcode again because it feels that it is on my wrist and that means that it is safe, but if I take it off, whatever I decide to do, it will require the passcode. This is the great thing about it, but how do you make it always ask for the passcode? If you would, for example, want the Apple Watch to ask the, for the passcode every time you take a look at it, then you have to turn off the wrist detection. So if you open up the watch app on your iPhone, it has to be on your iPhone, this kind of settings are not present on the watch, you have to go down to this passcode section. Okay, so you have to enter the passcode on your Apple Watch like that. Let me do it once again. And now if I click it one more time, it should let me in. Okay, so here if you turn off the actual detection of the rest, it will make sure that it will always ask you for uh, the passcode, but I'm not sure if you really want this. What I would recommend you and what Apple also recommends you doing rather than this, rather than deactivating the wrist detection, is to turn on these settings. Simply keep the wrist detection turned on, keep the passcode turned on, but what you have to enable is the option called unlock with an iPhone. This is something that is very useful. I don't actually have it turned on, but right now if I do it, you can actually see that for the security purposes, you're gonna have to enter the passcode once again on your watch. It's, you know, it kind of takes time because everything has to be secure, so let me do it once again. Anyway, if you are new here on this channel, if you don't want to miss the future content and future videos regarding your Apple Watch, your iPhone, your AirPods, your tripod or whatever else, then consider smashing the subscribe button and see you guys in the next content. Okay, so let me show you how it works. I actually have to keep it on my wrist because the wrist detection is turned on. So right now you can see that my iPhone is unlocked and this is unlocked as well. The watch is still usable. If I make it go sleep, now I should be seeing the passcode menu, but it's not there because the iPhone is laying around. But the basic feature of the iPhone unlocking the Apple Watch is that you can see that we have this blue uh, log at the top of the Apple Watch, but right now if I enter the passcode or use my Face ID, the Apple Watch will be automatically unlocked. As you can see right there, we just got inside only using our iPhone and we are still inside as long as we have the iPhone around and, and, and as long as you don't take the Apple Watch off of your wrist, because right now you can see that it is locked again and it's for the security purposes. I know that this kind of works but you have to figure it out the way it's going to work for you. So this is like an idea, take it and use it however you want. But I really hope that you enjoyed this video, this sort of tutorial, whatever you want to call it. If you enjoyed it, hit the thumbs up. And for more content like this, definitely smash the red subscribe button. And see you guys in the next video. Peace out.